Hey, what is up, guys? Welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be showcasing you guys this new Realm GUI system. So, we get a game with us. We can see. Wow, look at this. So, and I can click on these. It takes me to new pages. So now, if I want to go warp spawn, boom, I'm at spawn now. Um, say I want to go to shop. Say I want to buy some like diamonds. Oh, well, I don't have enough money. But you see what I mean. So basically. I've showcased this uh, little system off before with my with a diamond. I changed the um, icon just so it looks a bit better. Um, yeah, it used to be a diamond, and if you saw my recent two videos, um, I showed how you guys make the initiator, how you use the initiator target, and how um, you can use the new like slash dialog command. So basically, the slash dialog command is basically it runs this entire thing. So um basically how this works is when i click on this item so basically it's a new custom item i added i click on this item it runs the slash dialog command so that we're doing slash dialog open um open so this is actually using no npcs and um yes yeah, so that's why this is one of the best systems I don't uh, look. So I don't have a single NPC in the world. So we'll kill e type equals NPC. Oh, no target match selector, but I can still open it. There is literally no NPC. So basically, how this works, it's using a custom uh target. So okay, so basically, um, it's kind of complicated, but it's uh, with a Minecraft component. So basically, we're adding the Minecraft NPC to the player. So basically. I'm a NPC right now, so it doesn't affect anything like how you play, fall damage, so like I can go up here, um, I can still fall, yep, uh, I can still lose hunger, I can still take damage by fire, nothing affects that. Um, all this is doing is making it so it's possible to just open up an NPC at yourself. So you see, usually you'd have to do at E, um, type equals NPC, radius or whatever, blah blah blah. But now we can just open myself and we can open uh, it straight to myself. So now I just opened myself, smell of curry, it's right here. So you, can, you guys can see uh, my icon is right in here. Um, that's So I can add anything I want to this. But basically, instead of it opening up that, which you guys see, it's opening up a custom scene name. And those scene names, which I've talked about, um, mentioned it a little bit um they're actually really cool they helped you do a lot of things so let's get into how this realm gui works so I told you uh it opens up slash dialog so now it's doing slash dialog open myself okay and then to myself player target so now it's opening up the myself npc because i'm an npc to myself and then c name this is how you can customize what you want to display. So I have a GUI page zero. Boom. That opens up. Well, doesn't look that good in creative. Uh, there you go. GUI page zero. So now this opens up this menu, which you can have six different buttons. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And they can all do custom stuff. So this faction management. Um, I guess you can't have a certain text, like you have a certain amount of text you can't reach over. So yeah, that's why it's uh doesn't fix the whole thing. So what I've made uh in this little little preview, we have warps. We have warps and we can go warp spawn, we can warp shop, crates, home, hub, and geo close GY. So like this all this works perfectly. Um so and also, we have close GUI. So this is basically some some mobile players and Xbox players might not get that loaded in X at the top. So I recommend I recommend just keeping this in here all the time. This just helps so people can leave it. Um, sometimes it breaks for some reason. I don't know why. But so we got the warps. We got the shop. So shop is using this. Actually, doesn't work right now. I'll I'll be making a new. This, this, okay, so this whole system is going to have constant updates. Make sure to go check mcbehub.com. So that's where you guys are going to be able to download this add-on. It will be a link in the description um, at https mcbehub.com. 
Um, so you be able to buy, buy diamonds, buy dirt, close to UI. So let me give myself some money to show you guys it works. Uh, money. Well, I might give myself like two hundred dollars. I don't know how much I price these at. So buy some diamonds. Boom. Added two. Okay. Now I just got money taken away. Uh, accept display sidebar money. I only have a hundred dollars. See it works. Uh, shop buy buy diamonds. There you go. It works perfectly. So basically, easy system. Uh, how you guys are gonna actually be able to use this? This is the little bit complicated part, but it's pretty easy to understand. So basically, you're gonna go to my site. You're gonna head to mcbhub.com, which will be the download description. You're going to head over to the GUI add-on, um, and that's going to show you some little documentation. I'm going to be updating that documentation soon, just so it just uh, shows more stuff you guys can look at. Basically, you're going to download. Uh, so there's there'll be five different downloads down there. There'll be a MCBE, there'll be a zip, two zips, so behavior and red zip, and then you'll have a um, MC mc pack behavior in res and then you have the mc add-on I, rec I recommend downloading the the zips for the behavior in res so that's going to get you into you set those into your files and that's going to allow you to customize the stuff so basically all you're going to be doing is going into the thing so what you're going to be doing you go into the dialog file and inside that dialog file, you'll be able to add whatever you want to this. So let me show you guys how this works. So basically, um, okay. So basically, you'll be able to catch. So if I go right here, this is the site you'll be able to download it from. Uh, it's kind of cut off right now for you guys, but don't worry about that. Um, what you're going to be doing is going into your files. So you put inside of here. You're going to go into the mcbehub.com, mcgui. You're going to go into the dialog file. So this is entities. That's going to tell you how the player works. This is items. That's going to tell you how the GUI works. And this is the dialog. So you go into the dialog, into the GUI, and it'll open up this file right here. So uh, let me minimize that. Basically, this can be used to edit the dialog. So right now, this is the scene name. So if you guys saw in game how I opened up that scene, all we were doing is doing slash uh, dialog open scene name. So, uh, yeah. There you guys go. So you're gonna open up slash dialog open at self at self scene name. And that scene name is right here. So how we're gonna to wanna to change that is if you wanna change it to like player inventory or whatever you want. So I have it as GUI page zero. Okay? And this is the name of the actual NPC. So we're going to change that to whatever we want. So server GUI is just going to be the blank page. And right here, where it says text, raw text, what do you want to add? This is what it's displaying. We open up the menu right here. Okay. So that's the first GUI page zero. It's always going to open up GUI page zero when you click on the side up. And so when I click up, click on the warps, it sends me the GUI page one. Which GUI page one is right here. Okay. So when we, so then now we're changing the NPC name to warps, okay? And that's basically changing this top part. And we're changing server GUI. So this is just changing the little description. And now we have warp spawn, shop, crates, home, and hub. And you can change all of these uh, to wherever you want to TP. This is little shop. Um, and there's a lot more in this pack. Just make sure to go look through it. Uh, yeah so basically that's gonna end off this video make sure to go download those little packs in the description those will allow you to 
add this server GUI to your world. It's very cool. Um, it might take you to a link for Ty's link. Just uh, go through that. It's really easy. And it just helps me keep doing these amazing add-ons and stuff for you guys. So I'll see you guys. Uh, make sure to subscribe, like, and comment. Peace out.